Hey, Vizant here. So in this video, I want to look up Colossal with the hidden ability, Flash Fire. <laughs> Alright, so we're hunting for hidden ability Colossal Flash Fire. There are two dens. One den is specifically only for sword. And then, because then in that den, shield doesn't have hidden ability. That's possible. That's den 15. And I'll show you guys that later. Is like 50% for a 4 star and 25% for a 5 star. But the one we're going to actually grind on is Den 51, which is both Sword and Shield, 40% for 4 star and 30% for 5 star. So get there, you're going to have to fly to the beginning here. This is the one that's um, both Sword and Shield. In the area, avoid the grass, that red beam over there, that is the one. You want a purple beam though. This one you want is a rare, is a rare counter so you want to make sure this is a purple beam um so we'll get back here later so for den 15 for you sword users you can just do a red beam on this one if you fly to the top 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 area you want to go dusty bowl it's pretty close so the one i'm showing you are the closest one with pretty good rates compared to everything else so this den right here what you can do for sword just get a red beam and then you pretty much a time skip but we're gonna do the 51 it's all right we're back at den 51 and at this point you want to save because we're gonna do the reset thing because you want a purple beam so once once you hit the yes to save you want to press home if it's red beam you kind of see it right there you restart the game do this again until you get a purple beam happen what's a purple beam all right so now we got a purple beam let me see what it is crustal I am going to... it's already saved. But we're going to do the time skip thing. I, th I am offline, so I'm going to invite others. Press down, go to system settings. I'm going to go date system and then date and time. Turn that off. If it's on, turn it increase by one day. Press OK, press home, press back. Quit and it'll reset all the dens, which might give you a new Pokemon. And 2000 watts if you beat the game. Doing this until you get the one that you want. AKA Colossal. All right, flame body. That's not the one. Oh, it's flash fire. Okay, you carry, carry me, <laughs> carry me. We have traced the flash fire. I only took two colossals. So bad. Now right, I'm gonna let you Dynamax. Go all fancy, man. Even though, throwing at ice. Oh, do geyser or something. And this freaking twerkle is like ruining your, your damage. <laughs> twerkle make your water attacks weaker. Oh. Rock is strong against ice. Ice is strong against the ground, even though rock comes from the ground. You guys ever saw that cartoon about? Oh, yeah. No, <laughs> poor Cole. No, it changed uh, flash fire. Flash fire is pretty good. Just noticed how Torco just buffed it. Oh, well, Steam Engine is okay too. I think they're both pretty good. They're not bad. Oofter, man, zero eleven. Thanks for the follow. I think they both have the pros and cons. I know Steam Engine at least have you hatch eggs. Let me check Steam Engine again. Engine. Steam. Engine. Boosted the speed that is raised by a viral water, but flash fire. Flash fire. Flash fire is uh, for. Let's see. It activates when it uses damage by fire move. Once it activates, the fire move deals 1.5 damage, so it's pretty much an attack plus. 
while this ability is in effect is immune to fire attacks. So it's pretty much immune to fire attacks. And hidden power, blah blah blah. The fire Pokemon with this ability will activate activates the ability without the effect. If a non-fire type activates uh, has this ability, will this activate ability will, will have the effect. So pretty much make yourself immune to fire. While while steam engine, you can still hit, get hit by fire and it's water. And they're both they're both pretty good. You want speed or you want attack? Let's see. Nice to have options. Carried. Purple dog. Counter, Wobba Fett. Counter. Counter. Oh my God! Please counter, Wobba Fett. Please. You actually got hit. Oh, fat, you got hit. Oh. You actually did damage. Oh, fat, you did damage. Yeah, get rid of those shields. Alright, let's see, finish it off. Do I just use premier balls? I should. Yep. Oh. Start rain. I don't know why it still does a butter effect. I, I do kind of know why. Probably. Let it finish the round the way that the. And then it will be like, oh, it's dead. That's where the check is. Instead of just checking it based on damage. But I guess they want the effects to roll off in case there's something like Destiny Bond or something. Ozeraid? Did not. I even have one. You want? Should I hunt for one next? I'll check if I have one. Done. All right. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys like this, please like it, comment, and subscribe. I will have more videos like this. Let me know what you guys want me to do next. And I do stream every day evening Pacific time. So feel free to check that out on Twitch. Down below, I'll have the links of all my socials. And with that, thanks for watching. Later days.